Hey guys, I'm here today and I'm going to do the second part of my D800 tethering test. This time it's going to be using a USB cable instead of the wireless using the Wi-Fi. This laptop I'm using is a quad-core i7. It's a pretty fast unit and this laptop is configured with both the USB 2 and via an express card slot USB 3. Now the D800 is unique because it's one of the few cameras which does support USB 3 and because it's the camera which has the most number of megapixels so far it's actually maybe worthy of using USB 3. So today we're going to see exactly if there's actually any difference. So let me tell you about how I have the camera set up. I have it set up to record 14-bit RAW and I've also left the compression to uncompressed. Now that's not really necessary. You could use lossless compression but I figured worst case scenario let's see exactly how slow this is. So let's just do one as a test first. There it is. I'm gonna actually take five more shots now. Let's see what happens. There it is. There's the next one. There's the next one. There's the next one. And there's the last one. So, and here's the, it's still processing. It's still processing the images, it's done. Now, like I said, this is a quad-core i7, so this computer is actually pretty fast. I'm thinking that if you have a slower computer, it may or may not slow down. It depends, you know, how fast everything works. Um, every computer also has to physically save the file to the internal drive. My internal drive is an SSD and it's pretty fast so I'm not having any trouble with this I think for most people who have only USB 2 this speed is I'd say it's adequate you know the D800 creates large files so you know once again if you're shooting you're shooting you're shooting there's one file second file, third file, fourth file. I think USB 2 is fine. One thing that I've noticed which is weird is that before I made this video I tried to see if this camera works in USB 2 and 3 and it was kind of unstable going back and forth between the two. I don't know if it's the driver of the um, Express card USB 3 adapter, the D800, Capture One Pro, I don't know. I haven't had time to troubleshoot it all yet. But let's see if this works okay. I just turned off the camera and I'm actually just going to close Capture One Pro also. See, it says it, it gave like a little error message. And I'm just going to restart it. Okay, let's try this one. Let's do one. There's the file. It's processing. It's done processing. So I'm going to take a bunch of shots now. There's one file. There's the second file. There's the third file. There's the fourth file. There's the fifth file. Well, what do you know? It actually is definitely much faster. Almost as fast as I can talk. It's finished processing. So let's let this rip through. That's 10 shots. One file, second file, third file, fourth file, fifth file, sixth file, seventh file, eighth file, ninth file, 
tenth file. It's processing. It's processing. It's done processing. So definitely in terms of file transfer, it looks like USB 3 is that much faster. Taking a look at each one of these files, it's 74 megabytes. Let me take a look at another one, 74.5. Looks like they're all 74.5 megabytes. So I wanted to do another test now. And this is to try to capture these files into a RAM drive. The RAM drive should be the fastest thing ever in terms of transfer rate. So I have here an eight gigabyte RAM drive. Um, this laptop has 16 gigabytes. And I like to use eight just for random scratch things. So let's see how this works. Okay, there's one file. And let me just check out the capture drive. Okay, I've confirmed that it's in the RAM drive. It's one file, second file, third file, fourth file, fifth file, sixth file, seventh file, eighth file, ninth file, tenth file. And it's, is it still processing? Still processing. And okay, it's done processing. So is this a little faster? I think maybe it is a tad little faster. I mean, the computer could be a little bit faster in terms of processing. I think that if we were on a modern desktop, then it would definitely be able to keep up as these things just fly right through here. And that's it. I'll see you guys next time.